Speak handsome and beautiful, today we will talk about the mythological kings of Crete. The first king of Crete was Cress, descendant of the original inhabitants of the island, the Curets that mythology says helped the goat to take care of the infant Zeus, he reigned from 1964 BC to 1887 BC, but one of Doro's sons named Tectimus invades Crete and dominates her completely, he marries the daughter of Cretius and from this union Asterio is born, during the reign of Astreus, Zeus kidnaps the Phoenician princess Europa and has three children, Radamanthus, Sarpedon, and Minos, Astreus. Ends up marrying Europa and adopts his three demigod children. With the death of Astreus, his three sons begin to fight and Minos emerges victorious, expelling his two brothers from the island of Crete, Minos creates the Cretan laws and marries Pasiphae, daughter of the god Helios and the Oceanid Perseus. During his reign Minos asks Poseidon for a bull to sacrifice, the god then sends a beautiful white bull that Minos doesn't have the courage to sacrifice and ends up sacrificing another bull instead, which causes Poseidon to make Pasiphae fall in love with the now wild bull. Daedalus, who was an Athenian architect and inventor, creates a mechanical cow in wood for Pasiphae to have relations with the bull and from this union the Minotaur is born, who is later trapped in the labyrinth also built by Daedalus at the behest of Minos. One of Minos' sons named Androgus participates in the Athenian games and wins all the tests, as a reprisal, King Aegis orders Androgus to be killed, which causes Minos to invade the region of Attic, but he does not take Athens, so Aegis is forced to give seven boys and seven girls to be sacrificed in the Minotaur labyrinth, but a young man named Theseus who was Aegis' adopted son volunteers to go to the labyrinth, in Crete Theseus meets Ariadne and the young woman falls in love with him and gives him a ball of yarn, enchanting wool and a sword that Theseus uses to kill the Minotaur. When Minos discovers that Daedalo was responsible for building the mechanical cow that made it possible for Pasiphae to copulate with the bull, he is forced to flee Crete with his son Icarus, they use two pairs of wings that Daedalo built, but Icarus flies too close of the sun which caused the wax of the feathers to melt, causing Icarus to fall into the Aegean Sea, while Daedalo manages to reach Cilicia, Minos invades the island of Cilicia and a stratagem of King Kakalo falls, who invites him to enter the palace, and kills it during the bath by boiling it in hot water. Minos' successor was Catruas, who received a profession that he would be killed by one of his sons, due to which he delivers his daughters Europe and Clemene to be sold as slaves, his third daughter Apemesine is killed by his brother Altemenes, who ends up killing Catruas. Mistaking him for a pirate, he commits suicide shortly thereafter. Catruas' brother, Deucalion, becomes king of Crete, his Idomenean son participates in the Trojan War, being inside the horse, Deucalion wanting to bring Crete closer to the Athenians, promotes the marriage of his sister Phaedra with Theseus, from this union Hippolytus is born, who rejects the goddess of love Aphrodite, the goddess then makes Phaedra fall in love with Hippolytus who rejects her, Phaedra then lies to Theseus that Hippolytus tried to rape her, due to which Theseus expels Hippolytus from Athens and asks Poseidon to punish the young man, the god then sends a sea monster to appear in front of Hippolytus' chariot, which made the horses scared and break the chariot, thus killing the young man, Phaedra struck by remorse commits suicide. On his way back from the Trojan War, Idomeneus son of Deucalion is hit by a terrible storm on the high seas and he promises Poseidon that he would sacrifice the first human he sees on land in exchange for his life, he ends up finding his son, Idomeneus not, has the courage to perform the sacrifice and Crete suffers from the plague. 